Speaking of Maria, now my <laughs> eyes don't work. Damn, like what? <laughs> It's so funny. Your eyes never worked. The joke, the running joke on these seasons is that you can't see. Well, because I've been doing this for however long, trying to be nice to them. That's on you, bud. But you know, whatever. They don't need to see my eyes. They see all the glare. Mm-hmm. And there's some like anime thing where like there's glares. Like, right. Yes. Yeah. The new <laughs> glasses these <laughs> days are tilted down, so they don't have glare anymore. Well, n- niggas is broke these days, so you know. <laughs> I'm broker than you are. I mean, I still got it. Anyways, so <laughs> chapter three. So we're about to get an exposition dump. It's and time. Like we're about to head down Conversation Street. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, a bowl of chat. <laughs> What's in the basement in Attack on Titan? It's the same. It's the same it's thing. It's the same. I'm but ready. Let's not I'm wait. Not, I'm not ready. Let's go. Back it doesn't matter if you're ready. Here we, we still go. Oh, shit. oh, God. <sighs> Locked away by her cruel father, Salem was a girl who desired but one thing. A man. (laughs) She lived in a time when kings and their kingdoms were plentiful, when men and women were capable of greatness, and magic was a gift from the gods that all could wield. Hmm. And yet there she sat within her tower. Until one day, a legendary hero came to brave the challenges within the tower's walls. The people of the lands knew him. This is cool. Oh, everybody's having a lot of experience it. Hmm. Unlike those who had come before, this warrior was not driven by the prize of the young maiden's hand. He fought only for righteousness, and his pure okay. heart and courageous soul prevailed. He's walking like, what's his face, that UFC, uh, UFC guy. Conor Rager got the Shrek. They escaped the Fiona. fortress, and yet something bound them together. Ozma had been ready to give his life for justice countless times, but now saw a woman worth saving it for. Oh. And Salem, to her surprise, found her freedom not in the outside world she had yearned for. But in the mm. eyes of the man that had saved her. Damn. So, How wholesome. Where now? Wherever you'd like. The two A girl worth deeply in love, planned adventures around the world, and lived happily ever after. Psych! Or at least... Record scratch? <laughs> that's what should have been. Of course. Ozma, the infallible hero of legend, fell ill. And where all of the beasts and blades of the world had fallen short, a single sickness prevailed. <laughs> Oof. Oh. How could the gods let this happen? The gods, brothers of light and darkness, creation and destruction. Salem prayed they would see the injustice that had befallen her love and make things right. I will fight the gods, question mark? The domain of light was a sacred place. This is getting interesting. It was here the elder brother dwelled beside his fountain of life and creation. And it's accessible to the world. It was here where mankind would fall to ruin. Oh, shit. That's pretty. I was like Ozma and Salem were like Adam and Eve and they're gonna just fuck it up for everybody. That score! Oh my god, that score! Yeah. The choir, the brass, oh my god. That's good. Please bring him back to me. I understand your pain, but you demand of me that which I cannot make so. Life and death are part of a delicate balance. So, you won't do it then? Mm Mm-mm. To disrupt the cycle of- That's not fair. Oh boy. So she becomes deaf to control it? Let him rest. (laughs) 
Yeah, he's Lucky step Alex off. Smart right. <laughs> no. Oh no! Dang it! Hear the tale of Darth Plagueis. What do we do when we fight the gods? Nice. None it is Halloween. To enter his home, as men knew what monstrosities emerged from his blackened pools of annihilation. And so you must understand the Dark Lord's surprise when he found a lone woman kneeling before him. Nice. Nice. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. She hates that. <laughs> nice. Eee. Hey, Grim. Sam understood it well. She told him of her loss and professed that she knew only he could answer her prayers, all while careful to make no mention of his elder. Rise, child, and let your faith in me be rewarded. Well... But at what cost? Where am I? Okay. Yeah, right. Good first okay. answer. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> what have you done? I have done what I please, brother. You may bask in the powers of creation, but you do not own them. This is not creation. Do not lecture me. This is necromancy. I will do what I must to maintain order. No! no! What did you do? Bring him back! You dare enter my domain and show such disrespect! Ozma! I am abiding by the. Oh my gosh! Sure that guys. sucks! Oh my god. And yet the thing a mortal comes to pray at my feet before your own, so do you arrive to lay your judgment upon me. This is good. Eee, yes! Sandra again! We have our differences, but I have not come here with the aim to control you. It's Shenron, right? Same, however, <laughs> cannot be sent for her. This woman came to you only after I denied her pleas. Pleas that would have disrupted the balance that you and I created. Together. Then it seems I owe you an apology. Ooh. Allow me to correct my mistake. No! Nice. Dude. Nice. You monsters! I will you kill the gods. Oh boy. <gasps> when you first came to me, I did pity you. But it is clear now that your selfishness and arrogance have led you astray. What did you do to me? I, I took your magic. Immortal. immortal. Immortal? What? You cannot die. What? You cannot be with your beloved. How so rude! As this world turns, you shall walk its face. You must learn the importance of life and death. Oh my god. Only then may you rest. Uh, a prisoner once again. Fuck. Damn. Fuck. Eventually became nothing more than acts of spite and defiance against the gods. <clears throat> but perhaps the gods were not as powerful as they seemed. I don't know. <laughs> she had Damn. lied to them, turned them against one another. They were fallible. If she were to turn humanity against light and darkness, she could rid herself of their curse. Or at the very least, she could make them suffer. 
Salem traveled from one kingdom to another, telling tales of how she stole immortality from the gods, welcomed any swordsman to cut her down, and demonstrated her powers. With the kings and queens in awe, she pulled them deeper into her scheme. She painted the dope. pictures of a time this when they dope. would no longer have to watch their loved ones wither and die. When they could claim the powers of their creators for themselves, and in turn perfect their own design. <laughs> All they needed to do was mm. destroy their old Wow. Masters. Okay. Wow. The gods had hoped that Salem would learn from her eternal curse. And she did. She learned that the hearts of men are easily swayed. Boss rate, boy, dog. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Definitely gonna. Who has led you down the, the Rings vibe here? Lord Sora, <clears throat> Salem. <laughs> Remember me. Nice! Try me, bitch. <laughs> My own gift to them. Used against me. Yep. No! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, atomize him. Delete Judgment Day. Fucking Judgment Day! Magic.exe. Let's exe. go! Magic.exe, not found. <laughs> Yes. Of you thought there was no greater punishment we could bestow upon you? I'll come back. I'll tell the rest of the world of this massacre. Build a new army. You do not understand. There is no one left. You are all that remains of humanity. Okay. This planet was a beautiful experiment. But... It is merely a remnant of what this was. Mm-hmm. We will learn from this failure. I hope that you will learn from yours. No. You can't leave. You can't leave. <laughs> Come back. Still demanding things of your creators. Uh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew the moon had something to do with this. To a degree. And then that part gets destroyed. She stays there. And... Bro. Again, Salem was alone. Hmm. Nice. She cursed the gods. She cursed the universe. She cursed everything. Everything but herself. She wandered the face of the planet, awaiting a death that would never come. Until fate led her back to the land of darkness. Mordor. Mm -hmm. This was it. This had to be it. The Brothers Grimm, the pools of black that continued to give rise to horrific nightmares. If the Fountain of Life granted her immortality, then surely the pools of Grimm would finally take it away. Makes sense. She was wrong. This force of pure destruction could not destroy a being of infinite life. Instead, it created a being of infinite life with a desire for pure destruction. Hey -o. Oh, yeah. And in time, she would find her adversary. Don't snap me, bro. Mm -hmm. We are between realms. I'm afraid a tragedy has befallen your home at the hands of my brother. We have chosen to depart this world, but in our absence, I would like to offer you the chance to return to it. Son of a bitch. I don't understand. Mankind is no more, yet your world remains, and in time, 
your kind will grow to walk its face once again. However, without our presence, they will be but a fraction of what they once were. Damn. Creation, destruction, choice, and knowledge were the ideals upon which humanity was made. It's definitely some hey, hey. Legend of Zelda Final Fantasy. Leave them behind with the hope that you may learn to remake yourselves. If brought together, these four relics will summon my brother and I back to your world. Oh shit! And humanity will be judged. Oh, let's go. If your kind has e let's go. One another and set aside their differences, then we shall once again live among you, and humanity will be made whole again. That's an ultimatum. But if your kind is unchanged, if you demand our blessings while still fighting amongst yourselves, oh no, then man will be found irredeemable. And your world will be wiped from existence. Until your task is complete, you will reincarnate. Oh, that's not fair. But in a manner that ensures you are never alone. I'm sorry, but that world just isn't as dear to me without her. Oh. If I may, <laughs> I'd rather return to the afterlife to see Sable. <laughs> you will not find her there. Psych? <laughs> you mean... She isn't gone? Salem lives, but the woman you hold dear in your memories is gone. <sighs> Heed this warning. Where you seek comfort. This is good tragedy. So, will you? I'll do it. Ah, oh, because you're good. <laughs> Very well. Dang it. Dang it. Our creation rests within your hands. <laughs> Son of a. <laughs> and so. Ozma was reborn. Ha! How fitting. <laughs> Where am I? had found himself in a world completely unfamiliar to him. Cities looked different. Creatures known as the Faunus bore fangs and claws and were locked away in cages. And without the blessing of the gods, no one could perform magic like mankind was once capable of. No one but himself and a woman known as the Witch. Oh. During his years of travel, he heard the same frightened whispers that spoke of a terrifying Ozpin, Ozpin can do who magic. commanded dark hmm. powers in the wilds among the beasts and monsters. Ozma was convinced that this witch was Salem, and decided he needed to see what she had become. Hmm. She knew. Mm, fuck yeah, she knew. Call it magic or call it something stronger. But in that moment, the two knew exactly who it was that stood before them. What do we do now? Whatever we like. <laughs> As Salem and Ozma recounted the events which had brought them back together, each withheld parts of their story. <laughs> Salem, fearing Ozma would reject her, blamed the end of the world on the gods. Ozma, still unsure of where the truth lay, kept his task and the relics a secret. Though time passed and all seemed well, mm. Ozma's conversation with the God of Light still lingered in his mind. He had found happiness, but humanity seemed more divided than ever before. Are you surprised? This world is quite literally godless. These humans have no one to guide them. Perhaps that's all they need. What are you saying? We become the gods. Yeah. We could become yeah. the gods in this world. Our powers surpass all others. Our souls transcend death. They can do magic. We can mold these lands into whatever we want. What you want. Create the paradise that the old gods could not. 
The hearts of men are easily swayed. Are easily swayed. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Galadriel. God, she's been on point. Uh. Oh my god. Exactly. Literally. <laughs> What's that bit? Now the guards are gonna punish Yes. That's what I was thinking of. Damn it. Nice. The two amassed a following. That following grew into a prosperous kingdom. <laughs> And at the head of that kingdom blossomed a family. <gasps> uh, there they are. Aww. Frickin' maidens. Holy shit. Aww. They're sweet. He Dang quite it. literally made them. Are we sure this is right? You said we needed to bring humanity together. In order to do that, we have to spread our word and destroy those who will deny it. <laughs> what are we doing? <gasps> this isn't what he asked of me. <gasps> Uh-oh. What did you say? Great. <laughs> It was a miracle. Magic. Their children could perform magic. But what should have been a joyous occasion was short-lived. Ozma told Salem everything. The true reason the God of Light had brought him back. The relics that lay scattered around the world. And the day of judgment he had been told to prepare for. Don't you see? None of that matters anymore. Why spend our lives trying to redeem these humans when we can replace them with what they could never be? Uh oh. Hmm. Mommy? Uh oh. Oh no, oh no, oh god. Mama Bear is mad. <laughs> Cue the Dark Souls music. That's right! Ah! Expelliarmus! Thank you! Oh my god! And they're in Hogwarts! Look at it! Whatever! <laughs> Whatever! Jeez! Did they kill their own kids? Probably. Yeah, she can't die. He can. We finally have freedom. I wow! Ugh. Thus began a long and painful cycle of death and rebirth for Ozma. Some lives were spent in mourning. Many were spent attempting to forget. Oh man, him. amen, brother. But amen. No what? His mind would eventually turn back to the task he had been burdened with. And as the centuries went on, Ozma began to learn the importance of living with the souls with which he had That's prepared. fucking crazy. No matter where or how lifetimes. Her fucking lifetimes is so metal. If humanity were ever to stand a chance of being united, one thing was clear. He had to destroy yeah. someone. Knowing he could never rid what a the fucking world tragedy. through any this is more awesome. needs, Ozma sought out the power that of That cane! That pimp cane, baby. Armed with my knowledge, he believed he could fulfill his hmm. promise to the god That's of That's awesome. Nice cut. Where are the other relics? He asked me his questions. What powers do they possess? And though I gave him my answers... How do I destroy Salem? Not all of them were to his liking. You can't. Huh. Okay. So where do we go from here?
Kind of bring back the gods. That's a great question. Right. Bring back the gods. Yeah, we bring up our relics together. together and yeah, bring them back that's all you can so do that, is bring the gods back to kill so them. So that they can take away their mm -hmm. curse they well, favor. Yeah. Either, either get rid of the humans altogether, but I feel like Oz would somehow, despite having uh, a never-ending foe, still try to bring humanity together. Mm -hmm. Which sounds yeah. like you're just playing the game on hard mode, but mm -hmm. that sounds like something you try to do. And shout out to Jen, sorry, I just want to interrupt. Because Colleen Clinkbeard or whatever, she was the one that voiced Jen. She does Tannis and all the other characters in like Borderlands and shows. I was like, that's cool, that sounds like her. I know that <laughs> voice. Yes, that's awesome, it's good. That, nice. Yeah, yeah that's wild. That. Yo, no yeah. lie, I thought that after the gods left the world, they were just like, we're going to make a new world. And Salem was going to follow them. Mm -hmm. That was the random thing. I was just like, humanity version two, and there's going to be like a separate planet. But that's not what it turned out to be, and I'm still quite happy. I like how, yeah, and they've given you, and I like it too, because they've given you an idea of the time now. It's been like millennia, mm -hmm. thousands of years yeah. and shit like that, which I'm starting to kind of, like, I think it's cool now, because... We like, have a starting point, kind of. Like, humanity's yeah. been reset at least a couple of times, so mm -hmm. it's pretty fucking cool. I'm just surprised that they had gods actually on the same, like, plane of existence as you. Point. Like, you could like, go hey. up. Right, you could go up the stairs and see, like, oh, look. Isn't that where it always fucks up, though? Like, Oh, yeah. It's yeah, what you say. The they fucked yeah, up, Yeah, like, when you put them on the same level, like, that's where that's it kind of gets fucked wrong. up. Yeah. Well, even to a human guy and a human girl to take care of shit, and they fuck it up. We're really good at that. The power of porn. I mean, we are. Yeah. <laughs> Let's be honest. That's true. We do a lot of things for the dick. And the pussy. Another Thank you. Okay. I was like, oh, <laughs> yeah. Another thing I really liked was the fact that because I, I thought the gods were gonna just start fucking fighting like the second they like met up and it's just like, oh look, you're here and you're here. Consume like now for war. But they're just I like mean... no. If they it's this bitch. Just fuck her. Yeah. If they know how to coexist with each other, you would think that like you would think that they would understand they need to have the balance because if not, like, wouldn't he just be like trying to always fight with him all the time? I've seen I, I gods know. so much more fallible. I've seen so many gods written to like instantly like get tricked. You yeah, know, get tricked, that's true. Get... There's a lot of them that do. So I was, I just expected them to like fall for it again, but I really like, I was just like, no. They're definitely about the balance. Yeah. 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 That I owe you an apology. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. That was murderous too. You dusted the whole fucking humanity. That was ridiculous. Yeah. Shout out to Thanos. Yeah, the Thanos staff. <laughs> Shit, dude. I find the poor Ozma keep, keep having to come back. I that had no right. choice in any of this. Ozma didn't no deserve choice. this. Hashtag Ozma didn't deserve this. This was all this. Salem's arrogance. Like, it was so arrogant of her to come up to that god and be like, hey, give him back now. I'm surprised they just like, I'm just rest what the right right <laughs> I'm done my time <laughs> I'm just surprised they didn't like banish her to some hell or some place where Ozma just wasn't they're just like mm. nah you're just well <laughs> they're very in, in a way they did but I meant like they didn't take Salem out of the problem they just made her Right, it wasn't it. their intention, but it was more it was their intention cool. to, to teach, more cool. try and be like, teach her a lesson, and be like, all right, you're gonna lesson, you're you're gonna learn your lesson, you're gonna come back, and everything's gonna be cool. And it was like, <laughs> it's like her and Oz, Ozma were like the pinnacles of what they wanted of right. uh, their creation, and then yeah. they say like, well, this is a fuck up, so we have to just let it sit there and figure itself out. You know, I don't that know sort of self resolution. I don't know if jumping in the pools of destruction or annihilation changes this, but mm -hmm. there was an ultimatum put out for Salem though, and I wonder if it still exists exists because mm -hmm. the god of light said that if you can find the balance or the meaning or the understanding of like life and death right and wrong yeah. like if you find your moral compass will lift the curse yeah so i wonder if that's still at play because if that's still a possibility then you can beat salem would that be Os you think that's osman's like that's his go-to mm -hmm. like i'm either going to get the relics and kill her or i'm going to get her to a point where she realizes power friendship and, yeah uh, i feel like it, i could be wrong but it the story made it seem like it's been kind of lost, like mm -hmm. that. That they get it, it's going to be used more as a twist. I don't mm -hmm. know if anybody else. I feel uh, maybe Ozpin still remembers, but it, I wouldn't be surprised if he himself had forgotten or what. Well, he wasn't told yeah. that Salem could be like granted mortality or die mm -hmm. if she wanted to. Like Salem wouldn't have told Ozpin that. I think she probably did at that. Like when they got back together, that seemed like when everything hit the fan. For it's the an implication. Time, yeah. It's possible. Yeah. But the other side of it is that Salem may be the only one that knows so far. Well, now everybody knows who was in Jin's path. But like until mm. then, maybe Salem was the only one who knew about that piece of 
info. I could be barking up the wrong I'm tree. Still, well, I'm still, well, I'm on that trail thinking that <laughs> Ozpin just wants to get all the relics so we can get the guy. Like, I feel yeah. like he's at the point now. He's like, you know what? Y'all show the fuck up down here and fucking take care of the mess. Sort this out. And, I, yeah, he might be blaming the gods for that. We need an adult. Yes. <laughs> an adult or adult. <laughs> an adult, you're adult. <laughs> uh, uh, so yeah, that was a lot. That was, so. that was fun. That was mm-hmm. a lot. Let's sure. go to the next one. Why wait? Mm-hmm. Bye.